Bible Institute. We are very, very happy that you um, are considering helping us with this project. Because really, this Bible Institute has a real, real need. It hasn't had a roof now for over a year. We're not able to continue to have classes. And this is the only place that's close enough where all the students of the 14 churches can come and have Bible classes. And it's for this reason why we've had to close down the Bible Institute. But if you guys help us with this project, we'd be so very thankful. We are on the move. The guide said that uh, it normally takes three hours, but he's going to take us a shortcut. It's only going to take us one hour. He's going to take us uh, in the Brave River. He said, don't worry, there's only one waterfall. Great. <laughs> Just what we wanted to hear, right? There's the ocean right there. We are arriving at our destination now. Some children waiting for us here. This is right here at the Bible Institute. We just unloaded all of our luggage out of the boat and uh, they're making us some dinner. And here we got it. Mmm. Praise the Lord. Looks good. The finished product is right here. Holy yeah. bird. This is the Bible Institute right behind me. And you see the roof is all eaten up. And a lot of it is gone. With his daughter and these other pastors, and we're measuring the building. What we're looking at is a building about um, 100 and, uh, 120 feet long, probably about uh, 20 feet wide. We have a wall running down the middle of it that's higher than the rest of the building. So you can see here where the roofing has just rusted off this half of the building and it's all holy on the other half and uh, the wind has just blowed a lot of it land over here on the ground it's, it's all rough this is a piece of the old you see how um how you know, how rusted and how thin it it was in the beginning here with the director of the bible institute and he wants to share his heart with you this morning Buenos dias, Pastor. Mi nombre es Lázaro Rivera. My name is Lazarus Ludera. Pastoreo aquí desde el 2008 en este lugar de Chile. I have been pastoring here since 2008. Esto es parte de nuestros proyectos que tenemos en este lugar. This is a part of our project that we have in this place. Y esperamos en el Señor que nos apoye mucho. We're hoping and praying that the Lord uh, will continue to lay us on your heart and that you'll be able to for this process here because we have uh, cheese with beans and eggs and tortillas. Wow, look at that stack of tortillas. Glory to God, we're suffering for Jesus right down here. Amen, hermanos. Amen. Gloria a Dios. I just told the pastor that this will be a popular place for uh, the team probably after the construction in the afternoons. Here I am with Pastor Omar again. Praise the Lord. And we're looking at the roof at the building here as we showed you already. And we're talking to Pastor Omar about uh, the structure and how we're going to make it. And he wants to share a word with you. It's going to be a real blessing to work with you, Pastor Tim. God bless you. Green Bibe. Su nombre. Cristo Willow. Ah, man, Pastor Tim, you see these people are really excited. Thank you so much for sponsoring this project. We see you in September. God bless you. We're out now. We have done our job in, uh, in this place, and now we're heading out. Glory to God. Greetings from your missionary Ken Harrell and the Harrell Family Missions and Children's Gift Ministry in Honduras. Here we are on a wonderful adventure in the Mosquitia. I invite you to come down and experience an awesome missions trip with us. We go all over Honduras, planting churches, building churches, ministering to children. It's awesome. Gloria a Dios! Amen! We want to say thank you for supporting Harold Family Missions. Missions.